Hello and welcome to the first day of Vlogmas. Every day in December I'm going to be sharing a brand new video that is going to include all kinds of fun stuff for low carb keto lifestyle. So rather than Vlogmas, I'm kind of thinking of it as like Ketomas. Ketomas. Ketomas? I don't know. <laughs> so it's basically a video every day in December. Um, we're just going, I'm just going to share what I'm up to recipes, meal ideas today. I have a grocery haul for you. Pretty much just videos that I've been sharing as per usual, but every day of December, it's kind of a challenge for me. I've always wanted to kind of upload every day just for fun and see how I go. So I'm going to do it. It's going to be a challenge. So we are starting today, 1st of December, with a very small Aldi haul. I went to Aldi and I got some of my favorites and I just thought I'd share my favorite keto finds at Aldi. And let's just start with some veg over here. I've got spinach and strawberries. And now some people argue whether strawberries are keto friendly or not. I include them within my macros. I have maybe two strawberries on days when I've got room in my macros. But if you are a purist and you prefer not to have strawberries, then don't. But that I do. So I've got strawberries, which are just on special at the moment here yeah, in summertime in Australia. Um, I've got spinach and cucumber that can't, and avocado. That's kind of my veg that I've been going through at the moment. Um, I've also been having mushrooms lately a lot, um, but I've still got some left over from a cold shop earlier in the week, so I didn't need to get them at Aldi. So we've got two beautiful avos over here and a cucumber. And I've got tuna. I go through so much tuna. The other day in the video, um, I shared the tuna dish that I make, which is pretty much tuna, cream, cheese, mushrooms. That's like it. So we go through so much tuna. So I make sure I get some nice Poland line caught tuna, which I get from Aldi. Um, and moving on to the dairy section. Oh, we've got some macadamia nuts up there. I like getting these macadamia nuts and I kind of measure out a portion and have a little portion a day. Good for protein, fiber, excellent snack. Macadamias are my favorite nut. So I'm very happy to have those as a snack. Um, and I've got parmesan over there. I, go, I needed more parmesan. I go through this also so much. Whatever dish I have, I probably will sprinkle over a teaspoon or so of parmesan because it just brings so much flavor. And I get the Aldi one. And we've got some Colby cheese, cheese block. That's the cheese that I like getting. And it's Aldi and Aldi is cheap. Um, spreadable cream cheese. Um, so many uses. Fat bombs or I might roll up a, a smoked salmon with some cream cheese. Um, this is a new find, Persian feta. I love feta. And so I thought I'd give this one a try. Persian feta, classic marinated cow's milk feta with herbs and spices. So we can give that a try. I'll let you know how I go with that. Um, sour cream. I go through sour cream a tub every couple of days pretty much. Same with double cream, but I've actually got heaps of double cream in my fridge. So I didn't get today. I'm like, make sure that I do a little shop in my fridge first to make sure because I'm buying so much sour cream, double cream. Pretty much every time I go shopping, I get one or the other, but I have about two or three massive tubs of double cream. So I didn't need that today, but that's another LD buy is sour cream and double cream and brie. Another one. I haven't really tried this one before. Um, I thought it would just be interesting. Gippsland, local to in Victoria, some lovely brie. Aldi, I've quite known the cheeses can be quite good, actually. Really good quality. They win awards for it, believe it or not. I know. Um, and Silverside, that's one of my go-tos on keto. I love Silverside. I shared a recipe for how I make Silverside all ages ago. I'll leave a link down below. Um, I just boil it up and then we've got meat and we might have it for dinner or my husband will take it for lunches. It's just excellent go-to source of protein that we can keep in the fridge and I, yeah, just love it. And same with sausages, just check. These are the ones I get from Aldi. Um, they're kind of the lowest carb of sausages that I could find. Um, where's the carbs? Over there. Is it going to focus for me? Carbs, 2.6 gram per sausage. So not the lowest, but... Um, might have one or two and that's kind of the meal. Have that with a little bit of sour cream and cheese and I'm a happy bunny. <laughs> um, and finally, eggs. What can we do on keto without eggs? I have eggs for breakfast every morning. So usually my breakfasts are eggs and maybe a bit of sauteed spinach or I've been having lots of cheese omelets lately. Um, so this kind of covers a whole lot of basics. It might just look like a small shop, um, but it's really all my favorite Aldi buys. There's really so much at Aldi. Sometimes I'll do a bigger shop. I'll also get the roast chicken there, smoked salmon. Today I just got this um, kind of balance our meat out. Our meat, our week out. And we haven't had much meat lately. 
<laughs> so, and the kitties come to say hello, excuse the mess in the background, I actually homeschool my kids, not sure if I really shared too much about it, but I homeschool my kids and all their homeschooling stuff is up the back. Um, so that kind of brings us to the end of day one of Vlogmas. <laughs> oh kitty, you always like to get involved, don't you? Love you, kitty. Okay, so this is day one of Vlogmas. Um, if you're not already subscribed to my channel, make sure you subscribe. In December, I am sharing a video every single day, and I'm on the keto low carb diet, so all the videos are going to be low carb friendly, keto friendly. Um, and uh, so subscribe and join the Yummy Inspirations community, and let me know if you're an LD shopper, what is your favorite go to LD goodies? Let me know so we can be inspired. <laughs> Um, shop next time and we'll see you again tomorrow. We look forward to it. See you then. Bye